What's going on guys? If you want to run multiple copies of Diablo 2 Resurrected online, it's not all that hard to do. And this video is going to show you how to do it using Process Explorer. Okay, so first and foremost, make sure you have more than one Diablo 2 account installed on your computer. That means like you have one email address for one account and another email address for another. As long as you have two Battle.net accounts or more, you can have multiple instances going. So here's the thing. I've installed account one at the top right hand side and account two, same thing. They're both right there on my desktop ready to go. Um, you're going to want to use Process Explorer, which is from Sys Internals. The link to this software will be listed in the description of the video. So you just click on Download Process Explorer. And when that's all done, right, you're going to go ahead and put this icon somewhere near your copies of the game. I do this because it's easy to fetch whenever I want to do this process. So uh, you right click on it, you run as administrator. And when the process runs, right up here, there's a filter. It says filter by name. This is looking for what, what program. Type D2R, right, for Diablo 2 Resurrected. And now it's looking for that. So the next thing we're going to do is log into our first account as an administrator. So I right click, run as administrator, right? Battle.net launcher is going to go. It pops up the game and I'm going to sign in. Make sure the keep me logged in button there is not checked. You always want that unchecked so that you can log in and not automatically get pushed into an account. So I'm going to type in my credentials here and log in. All right. And now that I'm going to, I'm going to log in. Life is good. It's going to queue up Battle.net and I can hit play as I usually would. So the game launches. Right, life is good. We're playing, we're playing Diablo, right? Life is good. We're doing, we're doing something right. So once the game's going, give it a second. Feels good. We're in queue. All good. Okay. Game's ready to go. I'm going to click lobby. So now my character on my first account is logged in on the lobby. I'm going to press alt enter to reduce the size of the game. And now it's, it's shoved in the top left hand side. I'm going to now access process explorer here that I already opened up. Okay. And I'm going to click on d2r.exe. In this list of stuff, click on the second event. It should say check for other instances. You see how it says event? You've got uh, ALPC port. You don't care about that. Desktop, you don't care about that. Directory, you still don't care about that. Once it says event, you right click on check for other instances and hit close handle. It's like, oh, you sure you want to do that? Yeah, I don't want you to look for other copies of yourself so I can run more. You hit yes, it'll go red and kill it. It kills the process, done. Now you're good to go. You minimize this, same deal on the second account. Right click, run as administrator, and the same thing is going to happen. It's going to queue up Battle.net. You're going to type in your second account right now live. I'll do that right now. So here we go. All right, that's my second one. Toss in my password. And again, keep me logged in is not checked. And I hit login. And you'll see what happens. I'll be able to log into my second account and life is good. So I'm playing in one game on my main one. So go ahead and press, you know, whatever game I want. We'll call this Cade 1, Password 1, normal game. And in we go. And then on my second account that's running, I'll hit play. Fires of uh, Sanctuary burn, right? And I'll join this with my second character if I had one. And it's just that easy. Killing that process for both using Process Explorer is the trick to running multiple accounts. We'll see you guys soon, kicking the crap out of demons and having a good time. Enjoy. Maybe that Bobarb you level will also help keep that sorceress alive when you're doing magic finding, right? Take care, guys. See you later.